I am not the circulator of the petition. I walked with five registered voters in the city of Shasta Lake, one of which is Don Spurgeon, who's with me now. We walked, for example, on Joseph Street and talked to the neighbors, had them. If they wanted to, they signed the petition. It was under the purview of Mr. Spurgeon at that point. It's a very good publicity campaign on the, on the part of Ms. Lucero. I think most folks um, in the community recognize that. I think most folks in the community recognize that you know, there were two of us that came to the door, whether it was Don and I or whoever. Um, there were, we had 25 or more people circulating the petition, so. I think um, I think the community is ready to have Ms. Lucero move on and get back to some orderly conduct um, in our city council meetings and provide a stable um, atmosphere for the community, one that we we strive to uh, create. You know, worked hard for years, just creating a nice, comfortable place to live. And she's never been reasonable. She's never been wanting to listen to anybody but herself. And for what reason she's out there, I have no idea, but I'll be glad when this is all over and we can get back to having good people on the city council and instead of somebody that's up there making accusations of wrongdoing, corruption, uh, fraud, waste, and abuse. And who's very Sue happy. She's yeah. not a stranger to yeah. the uh, district attorney's office and lawsuits.